Hi everybody, Al Bernstein here with another one of my video blogs. This one is about the selection of Alfredo Angulo as the opponent for Canelo Alvarez in his March 8th fight at the MGM Grand Hotel and Casino. Now, Canelo and Angulo both coming off losses, ironically. Angulo in a fight of the year candidate against Arislandi Lara, uh, losing when the fight was stopped because of a terrible um, swelling in one of his eyes after it had been a terrific match, in which he had knocked Lara down twice. Uh, and then Canelo Alvarez, of course, losing to Floyd Mayweather uh, by a majority decision, though uh, many thought it should have been a unanimous decision, taking on the best in the sport and clearly falling a bit short, but at age 23, still uh, a fighter with a huge potential and a huge fan base. That brings us to March 8th, when he will take on Angulo. Now, in selecting an opponent or finding an opponent, there were a number of 154 pounders who could easily have been in the running. One, of course, the man who beat Alfredo Angulo, and that is Arislandi Laura, the Cuban fighter who has done such a terrific job in uh, the last year or so of making people understand that he is a master boxer. He just beat Austin Trout uh, very convincingly, had Trout down toward the end of that fight, and dominated virtually all of the 12 rounds. And of course, Trout, a former champion who had lost a close fight to Canelo. Many believe Lara should have gotten his shot, probably to placate Lara or to, as a uh, consolation prize, if you will. He will probably uh, fight for another title uh, on that card against Car uh, Carlos Molina. And for Lara, that would give him a chance at another world title. And he would hope down the line, still an opportunity for Nike to fight Canelo Alvarez. Now, as for the Angulo choice, here's the big positive for boxing fans uh, in picking Alfredo Angulo. Number one, he has a very fan-friendly style, very powerful puncher, and he will make Canelo Alvarez fight every second of every round. We are likely to see a real firefight. And probably that was part of the reasoning in terms of picking Angulo um, over Lara, or over Molina, who doesn't have quite as much of a fan-friendly style, probably they were looking for Angulo to create a firefight with Canelo Alvarez. Clearly Molina and uh, Lara, both excellent fighters, uh, depending on who wins between them if they fight, could make a good opponent for either Alvarez or Angulo, should Angulo upset Canelo Alvarez. And I do expect that fight on March 8th between Angulo and Alvarez to be a firefight.